People say GPUs don't matter when it comes to Minecraft. So yeah, today we're gonna see whether that's true or not. And make sure you guys watch till the end to see how I doubled my FPS with one simple trick. Oh, and if you guys want more FPS, then make sure to click that like and subscribe button because it guarantees you 79% more FPS. So first, we're gonna compare the FPS in a ranked scours game since I feel like that's the best game mode for benchmarking FPS. And the GPUs that we're gonna be using today are the RX 5200 XT and the NVIDIA GTX 1080 Ti. My CPU is the Ryzen 9 3900X and I have 16 gigabytes of RAM. Oh, and these two GPUs are pretty similar when it comes to performance. And I'm pretty sure you guys have already noticed that clips are not totally synced and that because I'm using the Hypixel replay system which is not totally lag free because it depends on the server and if the server lags then yeah the replay lags too and I'm also a Luna client since that's a client that gives me the most amount of FPS oh and if you guys want to support me and get some new Luna cosmetics then make sure to check out my Luna cosmetics and I'm also going to be giving away some on my discord so yeah, make sure to join my Discord if you want a free Luna client cosmetic and and some rocket mice or keyboards because I'm gonna be giving those away soon too. So yeah, join my Discord to stay updated on that. I'm recording both replays with the same bitrate and 240 FPS so that both GPUs have the same load. As you guys can see, the NVIDIA GPU is doing better right now. And I don't think I've seen the NVIDIA one drop below 1000 FPS. Next game is Sumo. The reason why I'm not doing any other duels game modes is because the server just lags and... Yeah, I don't think that's gonna be a fun experience to watch. Let's move on to another ranked scours game on a different map. And if you're a YouTuber and you're planning on getting an MD GPU, then think twice because these things are really, really, really bad for recording. I had so many problems and headaches with my MD GPU and I thought I was the only one, but no, I just did more research on it online and yeah. And it turns out that AMD's encoding is really, really bad for recording. I mean, if you're on a new driver version, then just forget about recording at higher FPS or even recording at all because it just won't record or it just crashes. I was even thinking of like throwing my G in AMD GPU away because of that because it was just causing me too much headaches. So yeah, I'm using older AMD drivers because they gave me more FPS and and these drivers actually allow me to record videos without it lagging. Anyways, NVIDIA wins again here. And for our last test, let's see how many FPS we can get on a Bedros map. As you guys can see, we have the AMD GPU on the left and the NVIDIA GPU on the right. And yep, I was surprised too when I first saw the results. Because I was all like, what the heck? How am I getting more FPS on a freaking AMD GPU? Because if you guys like looked into Minecraft and see that it runs on OpenGL, you guys will find out that OpenGL usually runs better on NVIDIA GPUs and that AMD GPUs have problems with OpenGL. So yeah, I was super confused for a bit. But then I started installing all the drivers to see which one was the best for my GPU. I finally came across the right ones and yep, as you can see, I doubled my FPS. FPS, just because I installed some older drivers and yeah before that I had the newest NVIDIA drivers Okay, now let's just compare this with a pack on and yep If you guys watched my last video on how to get more FPS Then you guys would probably know by now that if you want the most amount of FPS on Minecraft Then just go the default pack because even if you use like the 16x packs you won't get more fps especially because of the custom sky so yeah guys just don't get a texture pack if you want more fps so yeah, anyways guys if you want more fps you can just play around with your drivers but if you break anything then i'm not responsible i can't really recommend any drivers yet because i haven't actually tested this yet with other gpus but yeah if this video gets 5000 likes i'll try to get my hands on some older nvidia cards like something before a thousand series and then a 20 series and then a 30 series which is going to be expensive so yeah leave a like if you guys want to see that oh and make sure to watch my last video if you guys want more of this yeah i haven't uploaded in a while and youtube's gonna make me pay for it so yeah make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe if you want to support your boy and if you guys want me to test out different drivers